I apologize for the longest delay here. I was kind of busy trimming other of those tall plants in our backyard. Until it took me forever to start recording this video. It looked like a safari jungle back there. I wish you guys can see it, but... Like someone I know, there is no time. But we do have time to play a bit of a game. Well, basically three of them. So I'll play a new one, and the other one will be taking a while to download. So let's do the... Wanderling. He kind of looks like a yellow Goomba with a green plant sprouting out of his head like a Pikmin. I saw the trainer of it. He becomes nonsensical in the word for it. Non-stop running. Kind of like that game called Super Mario Run. And to find a way to block his path. Before he falls to his doom. So it's kind of like that game called All Leamings. You have to make sure you stop him. Well, bam. Before they fall to their doom. Playing English because we're in the USA. Extra lives, of course. Apparently I'm a cartoon carrot guy. And like every video game cliche, it's all pixel like it, which I love. Yeah, I know how to jump. Um, what's that? Heck yeah. <laughs> First line saying that. I needed this. Give me some of that sweet World 1 music. Self-awareness much? That's what I'm talking about. Let's do it. This. A video game, that's a video game character that's already breaking the fourth wall. You know, with everything all pixelated, it looks like from our own Game Boy Advance. In a good way. And the way these guys move, they move like penguins. Huh, I didn't know you could jump on them. Cool. Just like Mario. Speaking of it. Yep, totally copying the Mario game already. Ever fair, Princess P? It is I, Carrot Man, tagged up the Vegetable Kingdom. No matter how many times that evil witch kidnaps you, I'll be there to save you. I guess little mutants will stand in my way. Away. Once you're rescued, there's no purpose to date or anything, okay? I mean, it's 2020, right? Who knows what I... Put me into. It's up to you. Yeah, he's already breaking the fourth wall. Three, two, one, and friend news. Car or raw news. Oh no, my. Victor, you'll pay for this, Carrot Man. Great, let's try a, a less angry vibe this time. 
And... Mmm. <clears throat> the people of my vegetable kingdom should feel safe without... Candlelit, like Carrot Man, running around stomping on people. What should I say next, Dash? I try to the people saying, um, just some off friend vision of that boring old Turtle King. I mean, come on, he's like 35 years old. Obviously, people just love someone that can connect. Like somebody cute, lovable, who speaks for the people. Like the minions. Or a cow. Oh, so long. Hmm. That's it. Start rowing, and people of Vegetable Kingdom, ever I, since I we mentioned relationship, readership of this land, and yes, Carrot Man has terrorized your roadways and Neighbors is some kind of devoted pursuit of the lovely princess Pia. He, who I so kindly took into my care when her <coughs> original parents perished in that unfortunate poison drink and accident, but no more. Well, that's a little dark. This ends here, and now, now oh, as I need a beautiful Fritz Kabari, Robbie, whatever, should best trial upon one of you, this brave and once fallen soldier of mine, who gives their very life and Defending my portal, Megan Shifter. The ability to jump and the mission to finally destroy Carrot Man once and for all. Or waiting for him to come to you, little guy. Go, 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 save the kingdom. Ha, 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 ha. So Carrot Man is the bad guy. And now I'm playing this fruit shaped character. Ha 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 ha! 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 How was that? Not bad. But maybe we should take it from the beginning again, just for safeties. <laughs> like her face, she's like, really? Walk about weeds. Okay, so I'm unstoppable to not control this character from all the jumping he's doing. And I collect all flowers. So I have unable to stop him from stopping going. Yeah, let's try again. I press the right button to reset. Alright, come on. Alright, go this way. Steady.
And I'm dead. Oh yeah. One thing I've got to mention before you will get started. See these flower buds everywhere? You're gonna need to keep them if you don't want to die. I know it sounds a little harsh, but hey, dark magic is a heck of a drug. Hey, well, to make it to run off, you know. Tough, it is pretty cool that it makes them bloom. Tell you what, bring some beauty back to this land by opening all these flowers. And I'll give you something good. Oh, if you ever catch up to that carrot, just don't be too hard on him, okay? Ninja Vanish. Oh, thank you for telling me that. I wish I'd known that sooner or later. So I don't want to waste time then. Alright, stop touching the bubbles, you're going to die. Yep, I can see the heart meter there. Hurry, hurry. Move on to the next stage. Oh, there's that carrot man. So, basically, I'm the good guy. And carrot man is the bad guy. Whoops. Let's try again. Damn it! I can't tell if I'm supposed to jump higher or lower. I'll make sure I get all of them. And I missed. Nope, can't control them. And you're dead. They cannot give me enough time to... HEAL! Come on. Yes! I don't know how I'm supposed to get that treasure chest without exploding. What the? And I missed. Okay, I'm at the bottom. I'm at the scream. Damn it! Also, I don't need to look like those spiky guys from Kirby. And I missed it again. Alright, come on. Easy. And made it. I don't know how I'm supposed to get that chest, but oh well. Just for the bubbles. Through that pipe. Jump. Steady. Go. And made it. Didn't die that time, which is good. I got one of the love it cheesy. And this is less junk like my clothes. I love useless junk, but clothes? Like, seriously, who wears clothes? Uh, most people and most animals don't wear clothes for some reason. Especially the robins here. Right? Missed a few of them, but oh well. Right. 
Careful. Nothing there. Yep, you know, we're going to town. There's gonna be and then and through these walls here. Beautiful backgrounds, by the way. Spikes everywhere. Oh, come on. Nailed it! Also, how many more stages do I have to do in this game? Alright, get the key. Now I have to get the blue one. By the way, red is my favorite color. Blue is pretty much alright, because I'm wearing one right now. Classic blue, black... X stripe t shirt. Grab the key. Let's see where that leads to. Alright, got the chest. At least I'll get something before he dies out. Need it. Really? For that? And glasses. I thought I was gonna get some cards or something. Something cool. Oh, nope, doing makeup on his face? Totally different. Yeah, just I. This is gonna be a very tricky one. Gateway. Do I get stuck inside a friggin' bubble? Running out of time. Hurry. I get that. Go this way. I already missed a few of them, but I gotta hurry. And there's the cow. Hey, you are feeling it? Me too. Da 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 try that again. I could have gone a different pattern way. Impossible. Whoops. Okay, hurry. Now, buddy here needs more flour for his energy. And I fell down. Running out of time. Hurry. Stop running to walls here. 
Let's see, uh, let's go this way this time. Okay, you already said that already. Nope, can't turn around. Well, at least I got the treasure chest. And I got pants. That explains why they said about clothes. Look out for the spiky guys. Oh, you have to press A to jump higher. There we go. Okay, probably not too high. Now, I'm saying the graphics on here look beautifully well done. And nice music to listen to. Hopefully, this should not take too long because I'm either record or at a different game pretty soon. And I'm dead. I wonder how many stages I have to <sighs> go through. Well, there goes another one. And there I go again. This is gonna be a little bit trickier. There we go. Alright, just pause the game just to make sure. Um, Alright, there's more enemies over there. There's a red key. Which I'm guessing I have to get. Or not. I can still keep going forward. Oh, speeders. That's not a good sign. Remember seeing those in Super Mario 3D World? Those are always a problem if you miss. Yep, that guy just dead right there. I right, get the key. There it is. Heart meter. That's useful. Eh, good enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down. Okay, 1-14. Rover's Rush. Am I going to do like 20 more of these stages? Boom, you're dead. Be word. And I keep missing the keys. Let's try that again. Yeah, I wanted him to do that. How can I do that at the same time? Boom! Alright, come on. I got the key. And I'm dead. 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 
dead. Damn it! I thought it was going to happen. This seems a lot harder than it seems to be. Come on! Come on. So freaking stupid. Okay, let's try again. Damn it! After a while, I'm probably dying like a hundred times now. So when we do a uh, death counter once this is over, Finally. Freaking finally. Oh, there he is. Stopping and turning around. How can a player do this? They're collecting all of these all at once before a heart meter runs out. Let's try again.
Come on. Start over. I might be able to get the gameplay through how someone like this can do it. Got it. All right, I got it. All right, come on. Down I go. Come on. All right, got them. Yes. No more. Oh, I gotta say, this is actually pretty cute, too. There! I got all 70 of them. And we're only, like, 32 minutes in. Blah, 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 blah. And he's dead. No, 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 my... perfect champion. Where's that stupid carrot? Hey, Major, I was gonna say you are sure this guy right vegetable for the job? Seems kind of me. What? Yes, it has to be right. I made it. And what does anyone want with a pot and old carrot? You dare question the uh, me of the great little masters? How hard? Already? No? Blah blah blah. Can I just skip this? Oh my god. 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 Oh my dragon. Dragons are awesome. Ha 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 ha. Let's see, blah, blah, blah. I'll just skip all that. And then take him on. Ah. A big old dragon doesn't scare me. Trust me, loser. And this key will be mine. If it's the last thing I do, let's take him on. Hey, watch that. I won't... You almost hit me. Just kidding, you stink. Oh, yeah? Right? Oh, I'm roasted, aren't I? Yeah, serves you right. And we're back to normal. Oh, come on. I was enjoying being a dragon for like a few seconds. And he got two limes left. And he jumped on me again. What are you, stupid? Don't you know I have three limes? Later. Later. Hmm. Wait, are you a Peter? A tree? Whatever. Don't really care. Wow, a jerk. Yikes, he really got it. That's good, didn't he? Alright, Mr. Looking good as always. And... In Carrot Menace. I will not allow this menace murderer of... My people to continue. I've tried up waiting. Nobody else dies before you do, Carrot Man. Oh, she's bringing me back to life. A bit of her magic. 
Now let's see how you like in the power of boost fairies. I feel like the parent now go and turn to baby food. Ha 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 ha! All right, now we can go fast. What? Um, why is it working? Turn it thing out and start the next level? Oh, let's see here. Oh, duh. Can't believe I forgot to mention this. Well, for heaven's sake, we go out and out here. I forgot, this is just a demo vision. What? For the game? That's far as we get. Well, yeah. I mean, the boss dragon thing was pretty cool, right? But it, if that's not good enough, we can always tighten the screws up on our different team. Please, I may be an evil witch, but I'm just for jerks. We give them this, and next we're gonna try redesign your whole look. Nice, that's probably right. I mean, who even does that? Yeah, who indeed? Right. Well, help me. Anyway, that's how oh, it's for it. Oh. <coughs> See you real soon in the full game. Uh, thanks for playing, I guess. <laughs> uh, bye. Well, good. I'm glad that ended quickly. He does look like a yellow Goomba. If he had arms. So glad I played this game, and it's still, still downloading. The Resident Evil Reverse Beta is still, still going. This time I'm probably gonna make this like less than an hour video. Probably an hour and ten minutes. Actually, make it an hour twenty minutes. I know I make my videos longer, but this time I'll probably make it less than an hour and twenty minutes. So, time for me to play more Brahala because I cannot think of anything else. Ooh, look at that. Okay, I like the design of this character using his wings and using. The shield. Online. So, this one's free, right? Okay. Here we go. Let's you not I'll choose, let's see. I'll choose her. What's going on? What's happening? What's happening? Where am I? What's going on? Why is everything huge and 
us hitting bouncy beach balls here. This is so weird. I'm already not liking this. I tried that again. This is actually pretty cool. Oh wait, I'm hitting them on the wrong direction. I got 50 seconds left. Yep, they're gonna win. Because I keep aiming the wrong direction. Or not. Alright, here we go. And we're losing. Yes, yes, yes. Got 20 seconds left. Here we go. This is so weird, but I'm already liking this. It's usually up close to the camera. And it's over. What did I just say? I'll go to Braha. Matching yeah. game. Cool. Well, that's it. Ends in six hours, huh? I'll... In that case... <laughs> I'll probably do another one. I thought we are going to beat each other up. Because that would have been pretty fun. Also, a lot of weird blowing screen and... Oh, uh, Foo Song is in this game? Three, two, one, brawl! Alright, I remember I'm over here, and they're over there. Well, it is the summertime, so yeah, it makes sense that we're hitting beach balls, and they're... ...the owning us here. <laughs> Damn! Screw this. Training. Oh, it's getting closer, so... I'll do a bit of training. So I'll go with him. He looks awesome. Also, I never get tired of using the treehouse stage from Adventure Time. I'll probably do this real quick. For like less than 10 minutes and we'll get on to the new gameplay no 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 Run it on. Come on. Come and get me. Ow. 
Also, the scales, bro. I didn't do nothing on him. Yeah, I'll probably do it for like a couple of minutes. When it's almost an hour. Keep still! So each character gets the win six times. Be the shortest battle. Well, while I'm fighting this guy, I might say something real quick. Um, I might have to. I know we're in like in June second already, so I won't enjoy too much fun. I'll be very busy with um, basically the artwork, so do like newer creature designs. I'm still doing um, a giant worm, well, a different type of worm that's encountering Tarzan. Still have to do like the basic background. Oh, already got to number six. Oh, be her. Yeah, I don't care. I'll just go ahead and choose her. Or real fast. Basically, I'll be doing lots of different types of weird creature designs or random crossovers. Right now, I'm doing a... Obviously, an evil goat from the Tumbly Clink series. Which I obviously name him Ram US. Jack's very first villain before King Buzzard was a thing in part of his series. I'm gonna kick your ass. Ow! Quit it! Asshole! Screw you. As I was saying, and I'll be doing that for a while. Once I get his design perfectly finished, I'll show you the design on how well I did most of the other characters. There's from the past. I did when I was a kid, or ones I never got to obviously color in. I might actually redo Perry Terry Spider and his evil twin, which I'm still not done with, by the way. I tried to make sure I get the other characters perfectly finished, or basically another timeline. Because, you know, us artists take a very long time to redesign most characters, like most likely other animals. It's kind of almost difficult to make them almost lively as possible. Keep away from me. Take that. 
It just comes to show if I want to do some other forgotten video game characters or ones you might not heard of from other TV shows or short series or ones that are based off books. Because I might have to give like some ideas from other writers, programmers, um, designers, creators, most likely artists, musical number memberships. I mean, I'm trying to save enough money for instruments and to make sure I have enough work for it. Basically, good project to do an animated series. I've been waiting forever to do, but I don't have enough money to pay people to a do an animated series called that wild crazy jungle out there because I've been doing that such a long time since I was younger. I did like endless amounts of artwork and I just can't stop doing it. Okay, enough of that. I really want to make it to an animated series because we got like endless amounts of remakes, sequels, and other characters that they, they keep bringing back. It, it'll get old after a while. Also, Dark Rayman looks freakishly scary and yet so cool at once. Also, awesome backgrounds. Like, the other day I watched a movie called... You might not heard of it, but... <coughs> Excuse me. Called Once Upon a Forest. You know, that movie's really meant for kids, and it's like classic 2D hand drawn. Because hand drawn is already dead now, and they use like computers nowadays. CGI is good and all, but I kind of miss the good old classic 2D animation. Like this one that's basically a flash one, which is still pretty awesome, by the way. It kind of shows if you like 2D or 3D animation. Some 3D animation can be good, like when they did Final Fantasy and made it movie event children. I watched that a few times, it still looks amazing to have every day. Anyways, back to what I was talking about from the 90s. Don't say you never heard of Once Upon a Forest? Yeah, I don't blame you. The movie's basically about these animal children called well, in the film, they're actually called furlings, which is pretty weird. Instead of calling them basically kids, screw you. You wanna be Wink? And they have to save Michelle from horrible toxic waste dump when they accidentally they crash into the forest because somebody dropped a sharp glass beer bottle on the side of the road. Got infected by the horrible well, poison gas. And it's up to basically the main characters a female mouse, adorable on the ground, nervous mole named Edgar. I almost forgot to mention the mouse female character's name is Abigail and Russell, a hedgehog with a big gap at times. Now they had to find a place called Dembrine Woods to find a cure plant. Go up to our big adventure yet. That in base 
dangerous odds like oversized owl. And face those so called yellow dragons, aka bulldozers that they're actually called. And invent a fine machine to give the plant before it's too late. Time is running out and they have to save their beloved friend, Michelle. That's actually a badger, by the way. And avoiding the humans. It's a heartwarmingly good movie, by the way. I watched it. It's still pretty good to this very day next to Fern Dolly. Which I'll get to another time. I might review Once Upon a Forest in certain time because not too many people review it besides the Nostalgia Critic and Media Hunter. And I'm out. Let's get this party started. Resident Evil Universe. There's Beta. There's all those interesting villains from the past. This is going to be fun on the bun, yo. <laughs> That's what Bender says. I kind of forgot my old catchphrase. I think it's called... Dicky Dicky Tabby. What should I call my dad? Back then. Or. Osocio? Uh, no, that's Dan Lee. No, um. Yes. All right, here we go. You may no longer play this beta test vision. Wait, what? Well, crap. So much for that. Well, it's back to Brawlhalla for me then. So much for playing a different game. Sometimes demos will work, sometimes I won't be able to make you play the game because you have to obviously download it. So as I was saying, um, I might have to have like a few helpers to do the animated series, which won't be happening until whenever someone wants to help me on the project I do the animated series happening won't be well, won't be happening anytime soon I do like a fully length movie first and then Make it happen. Training. Let's just say I really need basically good help. In other words, more drawers. All right, hold on. Q. 
keep going. No more. Bingo. Hard, ah. Focus. All right, come on. Over here. That's right. Come over here. Out. I got like tons of animals to put in, like red pandas. Boxes, wolves. I might put a giraffe in too because they're cute. Bears. Um, snakes. Butterflies. Ladybugs. Zebras. Pink flamingos. I'm trying to think about other animals that need to be in the series too. Let's see dogs, raccoons, cats, rats, mice. Well, basically one warthog. And you'll find out why. Right, come here. Come here. Sucker. See birds. Ostriches. Oh yeah, I did not say ostriches, so yeah. Octopus. Fishes. A lizard. Iguana. Bunny rabbits. I could keep on going on about listing all kinds of animals that deserve to be in the animated series and the movies too. Because there's basically 14 of them based off my books. Ow. Come here. Uh oh. Around the village. City. Going around the world. Facing tons of pirates. Even a mad scientist. Street gangsters. Random cops. A zoo. A boy that wants to have adventure. And what else? Um, oh yeah, romance, comedy. Not to mention me and fun and all that. We have wacky hijinks and soons. I want to make sure it's like an interesting series to like those other shows we've seen many times, but downright cheerful. Heartwarming, touching, emotional feelings to it. Sad. Ness. Sadness. 
can make it almost like a musical number. And being cute. They get like a very remarkable animated series. Not like the same animators that did Steven Universe, The Bear Bears, Craig of the Creek, but more of my other personal style of animation. Just making the characters likable or really lovable at most parts. Most of them will be good guys, most of them will be the villains. You will feel sorry for them, or feel emotional, or you really want them to win at some certain point in time. Which makes it a very, in the word for it, interesting moment for them. I'm trying to think of other words to say about it's a wild crazy jungle out there that deserves to be an animated series for kids and adults. Just want to make sure there'll be like some good voice actors. And me obviously directing and wrote the story about the series. Make it kind of like a layable story of a orphan child is raised by a black panther lady named Kita. Make sure the subtitle says it correctly with the word K I D D A. I'm just saying. It would be a pretty good idea to make it to an animated series. And like the things we got nowadays are rebooted again, 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 and again. I would think it would be a pretty good idea to get to a perfectly good series. Besides what we got is basically doing the same thing over and over again. Which can be a good thing, or a bad thing. For me, I'm already getting sick and tired seeing the same old thing every year we got. I'm gonna get you for that. Hold still! Hold still, damn it! You know what sounds like fun? If you stop moving for a second! Hmm. So yeah, I really wanted to make sure it become an animated series. Because I'm really getting sick and tired of seeing these reboots Endlessly going on for all eternity. I mean, we already got Thundercats War, Bantan, Teen Titans, which we didn't want to be called Titans Go on how stupidly lame it looks. Those of you like it or hate it, for me, it's stupid. I'm trying to think of anything else that's not been rebooted, so it's basically... Well...
<laughs> Sorry about that. And I think that my hair is on to my freaking mouth right now. Gross, I know. Um, trying to think of what else was not rebooted. Oh yeah, um, Eat the Cat. That one's from the 90s, and that was not rebooted at all, which is good. They can just leave some of the good classic cartoons alone and not ever, ever reboot them. Trying to think of what other shows that was not rebooted into an animated series or long forgotten ones. Oh no, I don't. You missed. Hold still. Um, the only thing that's not rebooted is, um, do you remember there was actually a Donkey Kong animated series? Yeah, I'm not kidding. There was actually a TV show called Donkey Kong. Country, which only lasted for like probably two seasons, and that's basically it. That show had like interesting songs. Kind of weird that Donkey Kong can actually talk in that game, but for the rest of the series, you just hear Donkey Kong make monkey sound effects. It's a tune go. <laughs> All that little sound effects. I mean, I can think of other shows that did not get reboots. Like, um. The Brits Gifts, that's done by Hanna Barbera. Like, it's kind of like a copy clone of the Smurfs. Which I heard they're going to do another Smurfs reboot, but an Emmy of Sirius. They saw the same company that did The Lost Village, which nobody remembers watching. Heck, I forgot it existed. Pretty forgettable movie. But still pretty rarely animated. For children, of course. Also, those of you leave a like, subscribe, and comment if you can think of any older shows that did not get any reboots at all from the old 70s or 80s. Because I can think of tons of shows from the early 80s and 90s that did not get any reboots. Oh wait, I got a good one. I really got a good one this time. There's a cartoon called Midnight Patrols. A bunch of kids, when they sleep, they have to take on the evil Nightmare Prince. And restore Dream World the way it is. That's basically it. Yeah. That one did not get a reboot, which I'm glad did not. Because who wants to reboot an old cartoon? Am I lied, lads? Ooh. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, yeah, I like her design.
Hold on. Let's do this one. All right, hold on. Oh, yeah, right. I was talking about some older shows. Well, there's another one called Cradle the Super Dog, which nobody remember is watching either. They came out in 2005. It was a pretty humorous show. Based off Superman's pet dog that you named Credo. They'll have many adventures together and hangs out with a boy named Kevin. Have endless amounts and of foes to take on. Throughout his entire journey, being a young dog. And just like Superman has weakness of Kryptonite, we have a sidekick cat named Shrieky, which is a coney relief of the group. Find all kinds of bad guys on the way, too. This is a funny, weird show. And yeah, that's it. I can't think of any other shows that did not get any reboots. We gotta do better than that. Oh, you're down. Down you go. I really don't got much else to say. If any he shows that need any reboots, they deserve it. Well, basically not brave parts. <clears throat> Brave Star. So, yeah. Oh, wait, I got a good one. Something that really deserves to be an animated series is basically called Hidden Witch. Never heard of it. I already looked at the book of it. It looks like almost exactly the same as the other shells next to Infinity Train. Looks exactly the same as the other ones. Attack! Stop moving around so I can hit you. Oh, no, you don't. You 
gotta do better than that. Oh yeah, I gotta go on. Maybe Street Shark needs a reboot. Or SWAT Cats. Those are pretty good ideas. Why not reboot those shows instead? Or those dino... Karate Dinosaur shows? Do an animated series of Inner World. I only have like two games, so oh, why not do that to an animated series? I mean, they did do one short trailer before. Because that would have been pretty neat. Or. Hitting on Harvey. Never heard of it? Look it up. Come on. Gotta do better than that. I don't know what else needs a reboot. Oh yeah, gummy bears. Maybe it... No. Try not get them ideas for that one. Oh, there is already a mummy anime that serious. Was then done. Well, ten years ago. Um... There's already been Jungle Cubs. Um... I don't know what else that needs a reboot. Or remake. It's way the same thing. They read the common San Diego. So I can't think of any shows that need any more reboots. I guess that's it. I can't think of any shows that need any more remade things now. So, yeah, I guess that's it. All I can think about is just doing a animated series of If They Want a Crazy Jungle out there, and that's basically it. So, yeah. Um, yeah, okay. I think I'm plain enough now. I'm gonna have 
my dinner now. I think I'll go ahead and watch Star Wars Droids for a while now. So please leave a like, subscribe, comment, and send more reviews of my channel, please. I really need it. Please subscribe. Only got a few subscribers on this channel already. Thank you for watching, and I'll probably review an interesting movie or TV show in the near future. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all then, and I'll probably play a newer game in the near future. Thank you all for my gameplay. See you all tomorrow. Have a great time, everyone. Goodbye. Adios, amigos.